Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Natando Musibi, a new South African YouTuber here on YouTube. So I welcome you all to my channel, guys. So, guys, this will be my first video, my uh, get to know me tag. So you guys will will really want to know me first before liking my videos and enjoying the life journey with Tando M. So, my question is. Who is Tano M? So you guys will be wondering, who the hell is Tano M? So today, that's why I decided to do a get to know me tag so that you guys can know me very well before you just get to be part of Tano M's journey. So guys, these are the flashcards that have questions on it. Uh, some of y'all asked the questions and some of the questions I created them myself. So yeah. Oh guys, the sun is out today. The sun is out and I'm starting to sweat and I don't like that, you know? Because if I move to uh, to a place where there's no sun, then the lighting will be bad. So that's why I prefer being here. So you see the way I love you guys. I prefer my skin to get burned in the sun. Just for content. Yeah, being a content creator, guys. So let's um, let's get started with the question so yeah first question says what are your names and surnames hmm okay guys my first name name i'm like i'm in a war with my first name because it's an english name you guys know like our parents give us a <laughs> our parents give us like english names that <clears throat> we even afraid to even call it out in public but Unfortunately, I'm lucky because my name, um, it's like an everyday name, you see. So uh, my first name is Happiness and my second name is Notando and my surname is um, CB. So the next question says, where are you from? So guys, I'm from Pumalanga in Fulcris. Most people don't know it, but it's between Newcastle and... MLO, so yeah, that's where I come from. Okay, so the next question says, Where are you currently living now? I'm currently resided uh, in Durban, yeah, in Durban Central. Yeah, that's where I live. So the, the next question says, What are you currently doing for a living? I'm currently a student at DUT, uh, this is my second year. Actually, my qualification, let me just say that my qualification is a diploma in management accounting. So, yeah, I'm just doing accounting. The next question says, uh, are you in varsity? Yes, I'm in varsity. Yeah. So, the other question says, what is that one word that describes you? So, the one word that describes me is um, friendly. Yeah. I'm very friendly, I'm very kind, you know, so I'm always happy, friendly, any person can talk to me, um, I'm not that difficult, I'm not a difficult person, so yeah, I'm very friendly, yeah. So the next question says, um, who are you most inspired by and why? So guys, I'm most inspired by, there's this uh, South African YouTuber on YouTube, you can go search her, her name is... Uh, Salome Laka. So she is the person that inspires me. She's a content creator. Like I love that girl. The way she does things. Those are the exact actions that I was dreaming of. If, if most of the things in common, yeah, you can say that. So the next question says, tell us about your personality. Yo guys, my personality. <laughs> you know what? Let me just take this. So guys, let me tell you about my personality. I'm an easy person to talk to, but I'll find it difficult for me to talk to somebody. I hope you understand that. I'm very kind. Um, I'm a quiet person, actually. Most In most cases, I'm very quiet. Um, I love peace. 
and I'm a secretive person. Um, for example, like a person can hurt me in many ways and then I'll just keep it to myself and not talk about it to anyone else. I try to talk about it, but I just can't, you know. So yeah, that's me. The thing, you know, like it's rather eat me inside than talking about it. I'm, I'm trying to to deal with that issue, but I can't, I can't. So I'm kind, I'm polite, even a person that I don't know comes to speak to me or, you know, I'm very open. I'm always smiling, I'm always kind, I do have respect. So yeah, that's me. So the next question says, uh, do you have siblings? Yes, I do have siblings. I have an older brother and two sisters. Yeah, those are my so the next question says do you have a kid <laughs> hell no hell no <laughs> no i don't have a kid no i don't have a kid these edges i put them to sleep hey they in a deep sleep flat period guys period i'm beautiful i know that so <laughs> period those edges are behaving you know so the next question says how old are you i am 20 years old so the next question says would you prefer being around with people or alone i prefer being alone because i love peace since i'm a person that doesn't talk too much yeah i prefer being alone because most of the time when i am alone that's where I'll, I am able to find myself and think about important things. So the next question says, what's your favorite meal? Guys, I don't have a favorite meal. <laughs> Another question says, when did you realize that you are a content creator? I realized when I was doing my first year, last year actually. Because I started doing vlogs on um, on TikTok, yeah. Because guys, anyway, as I was saying, uh, in most cases, I like talking about about my life. I like showing people some other things are private and not all people need to know about it. So that's why I started making vlog what i do on tiktok so now i decided to take it further to youtube you know next question says which subject did you hate in high school <laughs> the subjects that i hated in high school was actually accounting and boom i'm doing accounting in varsity can you imagine first of all like when i was doing metric i told myself that this is the last time before I go there, like in, in grade 9, um, you normally choose subjects that you're going to do from grade 10 to metric. Anything that involves science, I was not good at it. So I had no choice but to choose accounting. Okay, business studies, fine. Computer application technology was fine. And math lit was fine. The problem was just it's accounting. Mm. When I was in grade 12, I told myself that this is the last year I'm doing accounting. It's the last year I'm doing accounting. Guess what? I didn't know that actually it's the beginning of it in university. Oh, guys, like. <laughs> like, what about you? I don't have a problem with accounting anymore. Like, it's not a problem now. It's fine, I'm cool with it. It's not like the course that I'm doing, I don't like it. I do like it since now I'm used to it, so now I understand accounting. Probably it's because in high school I didn't understand it because I was lazy to study anyway, so <laughs> let me just not reveal my secrets. Another question says, Do you love school or learning? Who does love school anyway, guys? Who does love that? No, uh, it's not that I hate school and it's not that I love school. I don't have a problem with it. But okay, I have no choice. <laughs> I have no choice but to study. You know, so yeah. So the next question says dreams. Okay guys. I don't have a lot of dreams. No, but yeah. So my dreams, um I actually wanna be a, a businesswoman. Uh, I, I'm planning actually 
that one day I want to have my own businesses not a business but businesses you know so oh actually let me tell you something I can actually do makeup I can um, do people's hair you know so now I want to learn on doing nails I just want to open so many businesses you know that's me yeah i just want to be rich guys i love money guys so yeah mm -hmm. who doesn't love money bags i do love money so i just want to have a lot of businesses just hire people and if you know like i want to be the owner like i want to i want to be the boss you understand so yeah here we go to this one gay this question says what's your deal breaker my deal breaker guys i hate being made a fool like you can't just lie to me where else you also can see that you are lying like are you okay like are you okay i hate being made a fool guys i hate being made a fool in friendships, in you know everything, I hate being made a fool. Rather lie and not know about it, rather than lying where where else I'm seeing it just in front of me. No, don't do that. The next question says, why did you open the channel? So guys, I opened this channel because I wanna share my life with you guys. No, I want you to guys to just explore and see the life journey of Tandu M, you know? It's all about entertainment, fun, you know? It's all about adventures, going out, you see, so yeah. So the next question says, what What do you see yourself, way actually, <laughs> what do you see yourself in five years of being a content creator? A content creator is all about sharing your life, sharing and most of the things, you know? so i actually see myself being a, a famous content creator like i want companies to to want me to advertise their things you know like you see those kind of stuff like it's like it's all about levels guys it's all about levels so the next question says do you have a favorite pet no I don't have a favorite pet. Mm, no, 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 no. I don't have a favorite pet. So the next question says, what subject did you love most in high school? So in high school, I loved uh, business studies. You know, that was my favorite subject of the moment. I loved it. And I wouldn't write a test and not get a distinction. I mean, like, how? 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 So, yeah, I love to business studies at school. So, the next question says, do you have friends? If not, why? I don't have friends, guys. I don't have friends. Uh, the reason is that I, I just can't make friends. I can't make friends. I can't make friends. Like I said, I'm a person who loves being alone. I can't make friends, honestly. I don't know why I can't make friends. Uh, so the person that you will see in my next vlog is actually Astia's roommate. She's actually not my friend. She's like my sister, so I wouldn't say she's my friend. So yeah, guys, I can't make friends, honestly. I, I, I don't know how am I going to explain it. I have trust issues, first of all trust issues with friends you know i'm just scared that i might get friends that will have a bad influence on you because there's this quote that says this is not a quote it's from the bible that says show me your friends and i'll tell you your future rather my future be secured and clean without any friends so yeah so guys the next question says are you an introvert or an extrovert? I'm an introvert most of the time. So most of the times um, I prefer being inside the house rather than going out the house. So I'm an introvert. The next question says, if you could change one thing in you, what would that be? I'd 
I'd want to change uh, the fact that I'm too quiet and I'm too kind. Please. Once you are kind, people mostly take advantage of that. So I just want to change that. As I can see, sometimes being too kind doesn't really work for me. So I'd rather be a bit arrogant, you know. <laughs> so yeah. This question says, why did I choose to study at DUT? Guys, I, I had no choice but to study at DUT because I actually uh, submitted a late application. But you know, guys, the full story of this, I'll just talk about it in my story time vlog. Yeah, I don't know when I'll do it, but I think I'll do it after my exams because right now I'm still writing my exam. So, yeah. I'll just do the whole story and explain everything after <laughs> after my exam. So now I'll just give you a hint. When I was in matric, I applied for something that I didn't like. Actually, not didn't like. It was it it was something that can be a side hassle for me, but not a main thing for me, you know. So yeah, I loved cooking and I applied for hospitality. Yeah, guys, UJ. <laughs> like I wished to study at UJ and it was my first priority. I didn't care about the other universities. My main focus was at UJ. Like what was I thinking? Yeah? Choosing UJ out of all universities. What, what was I thinking? I don't know. Also. So yeah, and <laughs> after my results, UJ rejected me so now i had to submit late applications in university only to find that that some universities are closed and some are not taking any late applications luckily DUT was taking late applications and luckily DUT answered me and said firm offer i didn't even waste time i just ran and went to accept that offer so that's how i ended up in DOT, so I didn't have a choice, you know. So in those late applications, actually, I I realized after receiving my statements that this is what you really wanna go and do, which is accounting, buffet, which is something that I told myself that I'm done with it in high school. Here I am. Hi, here I am. Chartered accountant future businesswoman here so yeah this is the end of uh get to know me tech you know so some questions if you want to know more about me you'll just ask in in the comments maybe i'll do part two of uh get to know me tech if you guys uh, ask more questions for now that's it guys that's all for my get to know me tag thank you for watching um don't forget to like subscribe and hit that notification button on get to be part of the family get to cruise with the boat get to know the life of tando m so this is me tando m the tando m that we are talking about hope you enjoy and i hope you participate in my channel guys so thank you for watching thank you so much hope you guys will be part of the family you know the you know the so yeah guys uh thank you Thank you so much. So yeah. Bye guys.